a racetrack on rooftops of Fiat factory in Italy. The racetrack on top of a factory is actually a very famous now defunct Fiat factory located in the city Turin in North Italy. When Giovanni Agnelli, the CEO of Fiat, had visited the Ford factory in Detroit, he then decided to expand production by adopting new and evolutionary production technologies in a state-of-the-art building that was innovative and unique from an architectural point of view. Built between 1916 and 1923, the Lingato factory building was the brainchild of Italian engineer Giacomo Matrucco and was one of the first buildings of its size to rely heavily on reinforced concrete. The building is formed of two longitudinal bodies, each 507 meters in length by 24 meters wide, joined together by five transversal bodies and two twisted ramps on each end. The cars were assembled while moving from the ground floor to the fifth floor. Each floor was dedicated to a special construction stage and with assembly lines, allowing workers to not move from their workstation, thus reducing assembly times. Originally, as soon as the cars left the assembly lines they could flow directly upward to the test track through the snail-shaped ramps completing the whole processing cycle inside the factory. Moreover, these spiraling ramps inside the building allowed the cars to be driven back down and into showrooms. The Ling Auto factory was opened in 1926 in the presence of King Vittorio Emanuele Il. At that time, production had already started and the office building was complete. Back in the day, Lingato was Europe's most advanced factory with about 12,000 blue-collar workers and 500 white-collar workers working three shifts in a continuous cycle. For its time, the Lingato building was avant-garde, influential, and impressive and the famous architect Elie Corbusier called it one of the most impressive sites in industry, and a guideline for town planning. The closure of the plant led to much public debate about its future, and how to recover from industrial decline in general. An architectural competition was held, which was eventually awarded to Renzo Piano, who envisioned an exciting public space for the city. The old factory was rebuilt into a modern complex, with concert halls, a theater, a convention center, shopping arcades, and a hotel. The eastern portion of the building is the headquarter of the automotive engineering faculty of the Polytechnic University of Turin. If you like this video, make sure you subscribe to my channel.